soon we will be implementing the biggest change to the Swedish Railways network since it was built, or at least since we introduced the Bistro. National train control is made possible by a new intelligent traffic management system, which will allow all rail traffic in Sweden to be controlled from a single place. The goal is to improve the punctuality of our country's trains by finding the best, most efficient route for every single one of them, wherever it is. If you work as a remote dispatcher, you're sure to have a lot of questions. Will I carry on working in the same way? Will anyone else be able to run my area? How will my workplace function in the future? We'll try to answer all your questions. Let's start with the most important thing, the new train traffic control system. It will give us much better systems for proactively managing train activities. Instead of having to solve problems when they arise, we'll be better to anticipate situations and find solutions before trouble starts. To do that, we'll have access to real-time information on train services across the country and detailed knowledge of every part of the track on the network. And everyone working on our network will have the possibility to share the same equipment and information. Your work will now be less about solving problems that have arisen and more about ensuring that potential problems don't become reality. For that to happen, we'll have to work together on a common train traffic plan with a system that gives support when it is needed the most. Making knowledge, information and insights available to everyone will make it easier for us to reinforce our network at peak times or to cover for illness and absence. What's more, it means that everyone who is off duty will truly be able to relax. The new train control system will be able to control trains automatically to a much greater extent than today. And your work will increasingly be about planning and conflict resolution. Even some direct communication with train drivers will in the future be managed by the system rather than a phone call. Studies show that this approach creates long-term stability and predictability in train services. A new simulator environment providing education and training is another very important part of the system. Using real relationships and real data, simulator exercises will genuinely be true to life. You're probably wondering how this new system will work, what it will look like, and how your daily job will change. The new train control system will be divided into three parts. One, time distance graph. A digital graph corresponding to today's paper graphs, which gives information about schedules, obstacles and special vehicles. An important change from today is that planning and information will be visible to every user at once and the plan will be executed automatically. 2. Time resource graph. This is like today's track usage plan. 3. Track network pictures. An improved view of the track plan available today. In summary, all these changes will make Swedish train traffic safer and more punctual by supporting carefully balanced decision-making based on real-time information from all over Sweden. Every employee at every traffic centre will soon be able to play a much more effective role in making sure our trains run on time all year round. <laughs>